Hi, I'm Marianna Murphy, Chair of the Board of Directors for the St. Petersburg Arts Alliance, here interviewing Beth Reynolds uh, at the Morian Art Center. Hi, Beth. Hi. I'm Beth Reynolds, Director of Photography and Community Engagement here at the Morian Art Center, and I love my job, and we're here connecting people with art for over 100 years. So Beth, tell me about your relationship with the St. Pete Arts Alliance. Well, I have been involved with the St. Pete Arts Alliance since the very beginning. I thought it was a brilliant idea, a way to bring artists together, to bring businesses together, to bring everybody who is in that art community to communicate and talk and not be so separated by everything. And so from the very beginning, I wanted to be involved because as an artist and also somebody who works at an arts venue, I really wanted to have that collaboration. I wanted to have that support and knowing where I could go to get accurate information and also just communicate with other artists. And so it's been a huge benefit. So the process is really interesting. So I take a photograph that I already had and I made a digital negative out of it. And this is my little dog, Yam, as a lot of you might know. And from there, we use a polymer, light-sensitive, coated piece of aluminum in which, through UV light, makes a beautiful plate. And from there, I ink up my plate and it goes down onto the paper. It gets run through the press, like a printmaker, and out comes a beautiful print of yam and everyone is different because of how the ink is put on so beth what led you to choosing photography as your art form my Life in photography really started when I was eight and I was going off to summer camp and I really wanted a camera to take with me to document my life at summer camp. And the reason I wanted that is because I was really super shy, I know, hard to believe, but I was. And the camera allowed me to be present and be a part of things that I normally probably wouldn't have had courage to go and be a part of. And so it also just gave me a lot of curiosity what will this look like in a photograph? And as soon as I started doing it at summer camp, I just fell in love with it and started going and becoming part of my high school newspaper, my college newspaper, and studying it in college. And I can't imagine doing anything else. It's just the way I communicate is through photographs and everything in the world gives me pause. Everything can be made into a beautiful photograph.